Hello there, this video will guide you on how to create a speed networking session in Aramid in Meta format. Let's get started. Go to your event dashboard and click on schedule from the left side. Click on add an activity and select speed networking to add speed networking session. Give your speed networking session a name. Select the date of your speed networking session, the start time of the session and the duration of the whole speed networking session. You can also set the timer for each conversation that happens during the speed networking by clicking on this upper down arrow. You can click on up arrow to increase it and down arrow to decrease it. The maximum timing being 50 minutes and the minimum being 2 minutes. You can also set up a matching rule for this session by clicking on change rules which will select the default option where anybody can match with anybody. You can click on rule based matching and select who will be matching with who and who will not be matching with who in the speed networking session. At the top you will see the positive rules where you can see different categories can match with each other and below is the negative rule where different categories are not supposed to match with each other. So you can just click on the select segments and here you will see all the categories. So the user type of category is available by default and these two type of category that you see here are those that are created from the custom field and mandated from there. Okay from here we can select different categories. We have three categories gender type, areas of interest and user type. In this segment, if I want to select uh, from this category, then in the second segment, I have to select from this category only. So here in this rule, all the males will get connected with female attendees in the event. If you want to add another rule, you can just click on here. And in the second segment, you can restart with other categories. That is, if you want to select organizers and attendees. So in this rule, all the male organizers, they will connect with the female attendees and all the female organizers will connect with the male attendees. Click on done once done and all the matching rules are explained out here as well. Coming on to the negative segment that is coming here. Let's say uh, we want the people who has interest in biographies to not meet with people who are interested in sport. The people who have selected biographies as their interest will not be connected with people who are interested in sports. And once done, click Undone. All the matching rules, both the positive and negatives, are explained out here. If you want to delete any rules, just click on this pane icon and you are good to go. Once you are done with the rules, you can click Undone. Here you can also add a speed networking tags. Uh, you can add up to 100 tags and you can also add a session description. Uh, the character givens are 1000 characters. Once done, you can click on save to save this session. As the event organizer, when you are ready to start the speed networking session, you can just click on the start session button from here or you can just go to this view schedule and go to the speed networking session and click on start networking session to start this session. So the speed networking session has started. You can join now and network with other people or click on join letter to join letter. So while you are on the speed networking session, you will be connected with random person in the speed networking session. You can also see the timer, how long the speed networking can last. And you can also turn on your camera and mic and converse with the person here. You can also chat with that person. You can click on this audio video settings if you're having any issues with your camera and mic or if you want to add a virtual background. You can also click on take a break or you can just click on next match to connect with someone else. And if you want to take a break of this networking session, you can just click on this take a break. And if you're ready to resume networking again, you can click on resume networking and go back to networking. The speed networking session will not end unless the event organizer ends this session by clicking on here. Whenever this speed networking session is ongoing, no one can leave this speed networking session. Once the speed networking session is done, you can click on end session to end this session, confirm it. And the speed networking session has ended. Now the people can come to the lounge and connect with others. The event organizer, they can click on go backstage and go to backstage and connect with other speakers or co-hosts if present in the backstage. Hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching.